Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. For aircrafts operating in sophisticated, diverse and dense threat environments, self-protection is crucial. We have seen Russia losing numerous fighter aircrafts and helicopters due to lack or not having appropriate electronic countermeasures to protect its aircraft. In the present day battlefield, it's absolutely suicidal to go into combat without proper electronic countermeasures. The prominent military aircraft manufacturer of India, HAL, has ensured that its helicopter including HAL Dhruv and LCH are protected via an extensive electronic countermeasure suite which is provided by the South African division of SAB Group. This suite comprises various defensive elements to guard against several different threats. These include a radar warning receiver, a laser warning receiver, and a missile approach warning system. SAP's Integrated Defense Aids Suite IDAS, protects the crew by enhancing the performance survivability in sophisticated, diverse, and dense threat environments. The system provides timely warning against radar, laser, and infrared guided threats and automatically deploys the appropriate countermeasures. Production of IDAS takes place at SAP in Centurion, South Africa. IDAS provides number of sensor suite combination and has integrated with a range of third-party sensors and subsystems such as directional infrared countermeasures and infrared missile approach warning system. The system is installed on an aircraft in a way that allows the sensors to detect radar ranging from 2 GHz to 18 GHz or 0.5 GHz to 40 GHz missile and laser threats from any position relative to the aircraft. The system reacts either automatically, semi-automatically or in backup or manual modes depending on the crew selections. IDAS provides radar warning functionality in two optional frequency ranges from 0.5 GHz to 40 GHz. Missile warning subsystem provides ultraviolet based missile launch detection with an angle of arrival accuracy sufficient for smart countermeasures dispensing as well as DIRCM queuing. IDS integrates laser warning sensors with the ability to detect four types of laser threats, which is laser rangefinder, laser beam rider, laser designator, and dazzlers. The system has a long and successful history with proven capability on many airborne platforms such as SAB 2000, Augusta Westland A109, Super Lynx 300, Boeing CH-47 Chinook, Eurocopter Cougar, Puma and Super Puma, NH Industries NH-90, C-130 and L-100 Hercules, Sukhoi Su-30 MKM and many more. The company has delivered numerous units to HL for ALH Dhruv. While SAP's IDAS is proven electronic countermeasure system, needless to say, India needs to indigenize this component and HL is now looking for new electronic warfare or you can say integrated self-protection system for ALH and LCH. The system will have again radar warning receiver, missile approach warning system, laser warning system and the countermeasure dispensing system similar to SAP's IDAS. It did make sense to import these systems 7 to 8 years ago when DIDO was catching up with these technologies. But now, when they have matured this technology, there is no need of continue to import them or manufacture them under license. So, in the continuation of the pursuit of self-reliance in defense manufacturing and to minimize the imports by defense PSUs, under Aat Nirbhar Bharat, Ministry of Defense has approved Another list of 107 strategically important line replacement units LRU or you can call it subsystems with a timeline beyond which there will be an embargo on their import which means after that no companies will be able to import them to India. The list of 107 items majorly includes LRU and subsystems which are to be used in advanced light helicopter ALX Dhruv light combat helicopter LCH, light utility helicopter LUH. It's literally impossible to name all the components 
but will tell you a few important ones such as the electronic warfare suite regarding which we have extensively discussed, health and usage monitoring system, active vibration control system, directional infrared counter measure or DIRCM system, target acquisition and designation system which is a electro optical sighting system, ground proximity warning system, night vision goggles, automatic flight control systems and many more. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.